Hi, my name is Finn and welcome to my journey towards a future closer to boat building and sailing. In this episode I take you guys for a little look around one of the boats that I've been working on uh, which is a Thames sailing barge, Roperta. I also popped back to Hastings for the weekend to go and see a couple of friends in their metal workshop and fabricate some pieces up for the barn. Now let's take a little look around, shall we? Okay, so Roperta is a traditional Thames sailing barge built in 1924 in Misley on the River Stour in Essex. She was built for the Horlock family who owned many barges trading along the Suffolk and Essex coast across to North Kent and up the Thames to London. They were used for the transportation of cargoes from rural areas up into London using the estuaries and swatchways leading out onto the Thames. So she has an overall length of 26 metres, so 86 feet, and a beam of 5.7 metres, so 18 feet 9 inches, and she draws 1.1 metres, and this is only 3 foot 9 inches. So as you can see, these were great ships for sailing up and down the narrow creeks and rivers that ran along the east coast of England. Her highly efficient sprit sail rig with 4,000 square feet of sail enables fast sailing, yet she can be handled by only two crew. So as you can see, there's quite a lot of maintenance going on. As we're out of season now, there's everything to get ready and prepped and back ship shape, ready for next season's sailing. So my next job is to tidy up the main companionway. So in that job, what I'm doing is sanding back all of the walls and taking the staircase down and going to repair any of the treads that are slightly rotten and give it all a good sanding and everything else will then have uh, another coat of varnish. All right, let's get to it. So since meeting David and Elaine and working on Roberta, we've had many great conversations and now they very kindly have offered me a position to crew for some of the sailing matches this year. So the first that I'm booked in for is the Medway match that's at the end of May. So be sure to subscribe to the channel and check out later on in the series some racing in some of the oldest sailing barges in the country. <laughs>
Okay, so I've just popped back to Hastings for the weekend and I've just come round to Incurva Studios, which is run, run by a friend of mine, Lee Dyer, who's a metal sculptor. And Nate, who you would have seen from some of my previous videos, he's come up and lent a hand with some of the heavy lifting and just really moving forward with the process of the barn build, which has been great. Uh, Nate's one of Lee's apprentices and he's a blacksmith by trade and does a lot of metal work and metal sculpting and... Anything to do with metal. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> um, so yeah, Nate came up with a great idea for making a artistic metal panel that covers the smaller door in my main doors to get into the barn. Um, so I'm just here with him now, I'm going to lend a bit of a hand and we're going to cut up a load of funky shapes, weld them together and make Maybe. up a panel that can be bolted onto the door. So yeah, let's, let's do some metal work, should we do? Shall we? I cannot see you. You can just see Jim. I do not know where you are. <laughs> the engineers. Very nice.
So I just want to take this time to thank all of you for watching my journey up to this point. I hope watching me building this barn hasn't been too boring. Hopefully very soon I'll be able to get cracking on with the boat. Uh, just got to start organising stuff now. The barn's pretty much sealed up. I'm going to build some racking. I can organise everything that is currently stored inside the boat. Empty the boat out and then we can start stripping out. Massive thanks goes to those of you that have donated or otherwise supported the project. Your support is a great help towards the production of these videos and purchasing any smaller bits that might be needed for the project. So if you feel you would like to donate and help out making things move along faster and help with the production of these videos, then you can find a link to my Patreon page in the description just below the video. So thanks again for watching and see you next time. So I rebuilt both of the So I've rebuilt both of the heads on the toilet. I'm gonna have to start again. <laughs> we, can't, we can't move. Um I'm just gonna be a double set of doors, 